Welcome to this edition of SAC News. I am Enoch Mendez. And I'm David Garcia. Thank you for joining us. Local drag queens slay the stage at Phillips Hall. More coming up. And something, is, something big is on the horizon for music fans. The communications department welcomed a transgender speaker to campus for a presentation called Journey of Empowerment. Reporter Corey Moronic has more. Erica Irvin says she wants to help embolden members of the LGBTQI community. Engage your environment. Find that special skill, talent, thing that you really love to do and exploit it. Develop competence. One of those purposes is being an advocate for the transgender community. SAC also unveiled a mural to honor Irvin's achievements her lecture to the students didn't just address the LGBTQI audience. The message I want to give to young adults out there is to see themselves in the future and take responsibility for it. In Santa Ana, Corey Moronic, SAC News. Students took the stage of Phillips Hall to entertain and educate the audience. The show is called Drag Education. It was part of a series of gender studies lectures put on by Sachs Communications Department. The show shines a light on the history of drag queens while mixing in lots of adult-themed humor. The performers shared their stories and answered a few questions from the audience. Before the show, the, the night was also used to unveil Sachs' LGBTQI mural. The University Transfer Center at Santa Ana College is preparing a send-off for students transferring to a university in the fall. The event is being held Friday, May 24th at 5.30 p.m. in Sachs Gymnasium. Students may invite up to four guests. To find more information and to RSVP for the event, visit the Transfer Center's webpage. The Health and Wellness Center was doing its part to help prevent driving under the influence. The event allowed students to go through a demonstration with distorted vision, letting them see what it's like to be under the influence. Law enforcement and other faculty spoke one-on-one -on -one with students on alcohol consumption amounts, the dangers of drinking and driving, and the illegal repercussions of getting a DUI. The music department at Santa Ana College is fine-tuning their act for a night of jazz. The big band has been rehearsing countless hours for their first concert this semester. They will be performing a few popular songs such as Charade by Henry Mancini, Summer Never Ends by Bill Liston, and Sir Duke by Stevie Wonder. The concert will be at Phillips Hall, May 17th at 7.30 p.m. Tickets are available online and at the door. $10 for the general public, $7 for staff and students, and $5 for, $5 for children. On the first Saturday of every month, downtown Santa Ana rolls out an art walk. The event showcases local artists, restaurants, and vendors who display their creations inside galleries and on the street. Visitors can also take part in creative activities and performances. The next art walk is set for May 4th, starting at 6 p.m. Go to dtsaartwalk.org for more information. That wraps up this edition of SAC News. Please be sure to check us out on Instagram and YouTube. See you next week.